Hi everyone, I'm Erin. I want to talk to you a little bit about going to a conference. So you've made an important professional decision to go to a conference and attend different sessions and so there's some things that you might want to keep in mind to make the most out of your experience. First, prepare in advance. Take the time to look at the agenda. What are the different sessions that are being offered and select the ones that are going to be most interesting, most important, most impactful for you to attend. Also, take time to actually read through the biographies and the information that they're giving for the speakers. That'll give you a leg up on knowing and what it is and who it is that you'll be learning from in that environment. And uh, you won't have to be sitting in the session flipping through, wait a second, who is this person? Why do they look so familiar to me? I think I've maybe seen them on social media. You can get all of your homework done ahead of time. That way when you're at the conference, you can make the most of your time there. So when you're at the conference, some, uh, some tips as well. First off, dress comfortably, <laughs> have comfortable shoes. Uh, don't forget about your, your physical um, uh, well-being. Sometimes there's a lot of walking or a lot of standing, uh, depending on the size of the conference and, and the event that you're going to. But also be prepared to have business cards, to make contacts with people, have a plan for your day. Think about what are the, um, uh, different, uh, uh, where, where are the different moments that maybe I'm going to need a break in the day? So maybe it's a lunchtime period and that's a great networking event for you. Um, and so you meet up with people for lunch, but then in the afternoon you know you're going to need a little bit of time during that coffee period to just have a moment of quiet for yourself or vice versa. Vice versa. So think about um, what, are, what is the way that you're going to uh, take care of yourself throughout that conference event. One other thing to also be doing is to take responsibility for your own learning. Sometimes I think we get complacent when we go to conferences. We think, well, gosh, what is this instructor going to teach me? What is this presenter going to tell me that I don't already know? I want them to wow me. Um, and yeah, the presenters should know their stuff. They should be prepared. They should have great presentations ready to go. But learners should also come with the engagement and with the excitement to, to get something, to gain something from the experience. So be prepared to think about what am I learning from this event. Uh, an extra challenge, and sometimes it can happen where maybe there's not a lot of sessions to choose from. Uh, maybe you do attend a session that you happen to know a lot about already. That's fine. Think about how you can modify what you're doing based on what the presenter is learning or think about how you might interpret that session if you were uh, the interpreter for that particular session as well. So doing a little bit of double dipping um, in that encounter. So the conference is, is ending and you're done and you're going back to your life and back to your profession and great, that was a wonderful experience, right? Wrong. Let make sure that the learning continues. So at the end of the conference, take some time to pause, write down two to three different things that you learn, two to three different things that you want to apply in your professional practice. Put those in a calendar, review them periodically. Maybe there's a follow-up action item on uh, some practice skills that you want to develop. Maybe it's a follow-up action item on people that you want to uh, have a for, uh, continued discussion with on a particular topic, whatever it happens to be. Just make sure that the conference event experience doesn't just stay in that eight to five uh, moment at one Saturday and you don't apply anything thereafter. Uh, another suggestion for the after conference is to share that learning. Have coffee with a colleague that Monday morning when you get back to, uh, to, to work and just talk about what you learned during that experience. Post on social media some of your favorite takeaways and highlights from the event and be sure to hashtag and show some love back to the organizers and presenters um, that you had learned from as well. In doing so, uh, you will be reinforcing your own learning but also engaging and allowing other professionals to learn from that experience as well and hopefully inspiring some other people to build the conference experience into their own professional professional practice. So what experience have, have you had at uh, conferences? What tips do you have for people who are attending conferences? Feel free to comment and share on that. Be glad to learn from you as well. Take good care. We'll see you at a conference soon. Perfect. I have to blow my nose. <laughs> I was a little bit concerned partway through there. Oh, but it's not too shiny.